Hi, my name's Amanda Moore and welcome to my channel. Um, we've got another unboxing today. We've got Glossy Box. My gosh, here it is. And this, this is for the month of May. Yes, 2019. I think this one comes in at 10 pain per month plus about three pain shipping so let's open her up and you get your booklets telling you about the products and yeah i wasn't that impressed with this month's box but never mind we get five products in here and we'll go through each product so let's get me booklet out ow just hit myself in the car. right Hey, glossies. Why do they call us glossies? We're not glossies. Our main box is filled with five full-size products, including must makeup must-haves, front-running skincare, and award-winning nail care. So, it's all award-winning, so you're okay. Let's go to the first item, which is Mud Masky, which looks like this. Focus. And it's an after, ma after mask vitamin syrup. And this retails for 43 pounds. Yeah, whatever, liars. I, I, I don't know, I don't know. I reckon they just make this up. Because that don't look like no 43 pounds, but never mind. Right, this serum, let me try that again. This serum is at the forefront of an up and coming beauty trend. The first skincare product in the world specifically designed to be used after a face mask. So you technically use it after a face mask. So that should be good. It nourishes your complexion with the vitamins your skin will be craving after intense day. Charcoal sheet or peel off mask treatment simply add a thin layer to your face after removing your mask and you'll have soft, smooth skin, which I kind of understand that because if you've ever had a mask on, you know when you take it off, you get like, you, your skin is craving for moisture. So yeah, I'm definitely be using that. Right, right. moving on, we got this Flawless Chisel Cheeks Cream Contour Kit by Barry M. Recommended retail price, retail price of $7.99, which is nonsense because I'm sure in Tesco these are about $5.99. So I don't know where they get their pricing from. They just put how much it could, you know, the highest price it can be, but I'm not sure. Let me just take this off. And this is a cream contour kit. It's not something I, ugh, I would particularly reach for, being truly honest. And Barry M's quite a cheap ass brand, but they were just a little like a smeared shit on my face. The chocolate, hmm, don't know about that. I probably won't use that. I might give it a go if I can make it work somehow. You never know, it might be amazing. I'm just being skeptical because it's so cheap. Um, but yeah, um, moving on, we have the cheapest item in the box, which this is, it's like Vaseline and you know, like Vaseline, um, natural petroleum lip treatment. It's just basically like a knockoff of, you know. So yeah, just open it up and it's just, you know, do a bit of that. Do a bit of that. Sorry, I look a mess today. I've got no makeup on. There's a reason. When I get to the end of the video, I'll sh I'll tell you why I didn't put makeup on. So, yeah, that is two ninety nine RRP recommended retail price. So, sorry if you can hear my daughter screaming. Uh, this looked really nice actually. Um, I did like the look of this. Uh, I love the colour, it's a really unique colour actually. And I'm always running out to nail polishes. So this is the Nail Berry, Nail Berry, I like the sound of that. Love Me Tender, Love Me True. I was gonna sing a song then, but this is the Nail Polish. Meet the next generation of the state-of-the-art polish. Part of Nail Berry's revolutionary Oxygeni range, 
though. It's multi award winning, so this is multi award winning. Yeah, you need this. Nail polish uses patented technology to deliver a healthier manicure without compromising on colour quality. It covers your nail with a unique film which allows air and water vapour to pass through it, ensuring your cuticles are protected even while wearing nail polish. You're going back, you're going to look so a la mode, mode, mode. And the recommended retail price of this is £14.50. So, yeah. I, I was more excited about this than anything. I do like this. And the last item is this. I It looks like a drink, doesn't it? Because it says on me, do not drink. This is a uh, shake and shot rubber firming mask which looks really, 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 really strange, but Shake and Shot Rubber Hydro Mask. Oh, I think this is, no, this is the Firming Mask, sorry. You can either get the Hydro Mask or the Firming, and I've got the Firming Mask. When it comes to high-performance skincare innovations, Dr. Jart Plus is king. He's king, apparently. So, they've created the latest trend in masking a shaken rubber face mask. Shaken Shot Rubber Mask is a fun DIY rubbery modeling mask that nourishes your skin with high potency active ingredients, leaving you with a healthy and dewy looking complexion. Dewy, give me the dew. I love dew. Better yet, it's innovative cream. I can never, I managed to say it today. I can never say it. It's innovative. Innovative, innovative, yes. Innovative, yeah, I got, I got it today, I got it. Some days I cannot say that word, but I have it today. Cream to sheet formula to penetrate deeper into the skin than the traditional sheet mask. Moisturizing your skin quickly and effectively. Recommended retail price? Eight pound. So I thought we, because this looked the most funnest item in there, in fact, I just thought this looked fun. So should we try it on camera? Yeah, I think we should, yes, definitely. And this is eight pounds. So I look this, this look, oh, sorry, let me do that again. Look at this. That's kind of spooky. It looks like one of those dolls I used to have when I was a kid and I used to put a bottle in the night, remember? And they used to pee, like, I can't remember, like Baby Annabelle, but I always remember those dolls. I didn't like dolls when I was growing up. I just used to like pull their eyeballs and tear their heads off, being honest. I don't know, it was a bit cruel. But yeah, let's have a go with this. Inside, you've got a spatula and you've got two of these. What you have to do is mix these both into this cup, give it a shake and then apply it with your spatula, but I'm assuming that it hardens on your face so you can take it all off. So I'm, I'm gonna have a go now. I can't wait. That's why I didn't put makeup on because I just wanted to have a go with this. So let's rip that off. Um, oh, this is like a water. Where is this thing? Yeah, this is this. You can hear it. Like I said, I think oh it's like it's like it's like piss. It's coming out like piss. Oh yeah. Right. That is in there. Sorry about my back. Look, breathing man, breathing. That is in there, so, yeah, sorry. So now we have to put this in there, so. Can you see? Sorry, my daughter's making a hell of a bloody noise. If you don't like kids, then sorry. I know, because I watch channels and people are like, will you shut your kids up? I'm like, yeah, I know, chloroform and the fact that I'm not allowed. But I'm not going to reshoot this video just for the sake of um, those pair, haven't I? 
but ah it's going everywhere it's very globby shake it up right it's no let me just get every last drop because i want this to work so this looks friggin weird as the f i'm gonna try not to swear in my videos it just comes out i don't know because i'm just a knob right yeah I think that sorry I'll I'll try and put this in the editor and fast forward this bit if I can be asked later but yeah now I'm pretty sure you've got to use it within two to three minutes so make sure the lid's on tight so it says on the bottle do not drink this like you're gonna drink it well I suppose some people are does look like right, I can yeah apply a thin layer close the lids and shake until mix so yeah what is happening there's something magical happening no there's not so yeah uh, let me get a bobble or something Right, I'll be right back then. Shit, I just realised I've got to work fast. It's been about two minutes and you're supposed to put this on your face within two to three minutes. So I've mixed it. Ew, it looks disgusting shit. Right, I better work fast, peeps. I got my mirror. This should be fun. I don't know if it's properly mixed actually. Because I'm doing it in a rush now. Voila. And we look. <laughs> just went on my top. Ah, that is a little bit difficult. I think that's done um, that was supposed to be a fun project I'm not quite sure about fun that was hard bloody work I felt like I was have you ever like done a cake and you know the buttercream icing with the palette knife and you um, go around and smooth it all out that's what my face felt like like I was basically icing my face but yeah uh, I've used all that mixture in there, uh, apart from a dab or two, but we'll leave that. So now we'll leave it 20 minutes, um, I'm going to go off camera for 20 minutes and then I will come back. I'm sure it's supposed to harden so we'll see what it does, alright? That's been on 20 minutes, and it still looks wet but... That's just, I can't wait no longer. No, it doesn't do what it's supposed to do. Like, I thought it was supposed to come off in one big face. That's a bit shit, isn't it? Maybe I didn't apply it right, but I've given in now. That's been on a good 20 odd minutes. So yeah, I'm back after doing that, uh, washing that mask off. I was a bit disappointed. I thought it was going to be like, come off in, I mean, it was no fun. It's supposed to be fun, but it wasn't fun because you're supposed to be able to take it off in one giant, like a swoop. But I I think maybe it's because it's already raining today maybe the moisture got to it so yeah a bit of a bummer but let me know who else got this box 
how they did with it. So yeah, well, because it was a mask, I'm gonna try this 43 pound muddy mask now because you're supposed to put this on after a mask. So let's load my fingers up and just Mmm, it doesn't smell bad, but yeah. Hmm, feels all right. It's still not worth 43 quid, in my opinion. Not unless it does the fucking iron. I'm oh, sorry, not unless it does the friggin' ironing. So, okay, yeah, I've officially had an opening my skin does look and feel quite nice actually after that mask so three quid i wouldn't read but i would not buy that for a pain you've got to be joking so yeah let's just have one last recap we got this weird thing that to me didn't kind of work out it said but i've used it now uh we got the barry m which i don't think i'm going to use that uh this which is just basically a vaseline basic thing we got this mask which uh this thing to use after a mask um yeah i think this is nice the two best items in this box if you got this to work this was nice actually but these two were the ones i'm probably going to use again so yeah that is a glossy box for may 2019 and yeah, I don't know. But look, look, you'll shit your pants now. Look, next month we've got an 85. Look, they give you a sneak peek into June, but we have focus. I don't think it's going to focus, but we have the Avant 85 pound silky and lightweight primer. So, yeah, I was going to cancel my. I'm not sure what's. No, I'll keep going. But. I won the 85 pound primer next month. So yeah, if you liked anything, please subscribe. Hit my red subscribe button and my bell. I'm always doing beauty crap. I just placed an order today with um, Superdrug. Uh, I wanted to test out a few more products for you. So yeah, please hit my bell. And yeah, I love you as ever watching. And yeah, I will see you on my next video. Bye.